Hey, how's it going guys? This is your boy Deuce back with another video. And this is an updated video to the Razor Core video I made a while ago with the Dell XPS uh, 15 with the Thunderbolt setup. Now, uh, since then I done had a lot of other laptops, but I'm still doing the eGPU setups. Uh, I love it guys, to be honest with you. Uh, they've been working pretty well for me. Uh, since then I done, I done been gaming uh, quite a bit. But um, basically, I done upgraded. Um, the, the, the computer that you're seeing right here is the same computer I had in the last few videos. Um, the X1 Yoga. I still got the Alienware, but I decided that I want to use the X1 Yoga uh, for now. More so because it's a little bit easier not having an extra um, power cord hooked up and plus the Thunderbolt cable. So I decided to just use this one because this is a dual core processor. It actually gets charged from the Razer Core while at the same time giving me that giving me that uh, graphics performance that I need. Um, so yeah, so all right. So basically, I still got. Let me walk around here. I still got the Razer Core here, but this time I upgraded from a GTX 1070 to the GTX 1080 Ti. And guys, oh my goodness. Now, don't get me wrong, you still lose a little bit of performance um, running it through the external display. But right now, it's not really that bad. Um, actually, it's not that bad at all, to be honest with you. Uh, for the most part, by being a 1080 Ti, it's a little bit overkill for this processor. But hey, it's running pretty goddamn good, and I love it. So, starting off with this game, I got everything, uh, everything go high. Go over here. Ah, go down. There we go. I got everything on high. Actually, take that back. Scratch that. I think everything is on ultra. Yep. Everything is on ultra. And on top of that, I'm running at the max resolution, 1440p. That ain't nothing for this graphics card, guys. I'm just be honest with you. That ain't nothing. Um, the game runs incredibly smooth. Absolutely love it. I'm getting attacked by God damn, what the fuck? Okay. There we go. With one hand on it. <laughs> nah. But um, yeah, guys, I love it. Um, I'm currently waiting for the Dell XPS 15 2 and 1 to come out so I can do a video on that. Um, I've been anticipating that laptop for a minute now ever since they announced that at CES 18. Uh, been waiting on it, waiting on it, waiting on it. It's supposed to come out in a couple days. Hopefully, that's um, I guess what the Alienware um, vice president or whoever said. Uh, but guys, updated. Love it, guys. Um, get you an eGPU setup if you got a regular laptop with Thunderbolt. Make sure you make sure it has 40 gigs because the little XPS had uh, it had 20 gigs and that pretty much cut the performance down in half on top of the performance loss that you already get just for not running in a desktop. I will tell you this though, um, when I was running this on my Alien, my, my Alienware 13 with the uh, was it, quad core processor that I had, the 77K HQ, oh my God, guys, <laughs> ran like butter, dude. It ran like butter, it was good. Um, definitely not that much of a performance loss at all, even when I was running through the, uh, the external display. Now, when you hook this up to a monitor, guys, you do get a performance boost. Uh, it's a pretty goddamn good one, too. Whenever you hook the, the, the GPU directly into a monitor, monitor, TV screen, whatever, as long as you hook it up to a monitor of some sort, um, you do get a performance boost, a big, pretty big performance boost over the external display. Um, but if you like me, it's not really gonna, it's not really gonna mess you up. Uh, personally, I like, I like using my laptop screen. And to be honest with you, the performance on here is, uh, it's good enough. Trust me, I ain't got no problems at all. I ain't even worried about it. Um, just to show you a little bit too, like, I'm gonna quit this game, go back, load up a fresh, um, a fresh game because right now I was getting attacked by a tiger and then like somebody else started shooting at me, so give you a fresh start. By the way, this is the Yoga, X1 Yoga OLED Gen 2. Uh, just in case you guys want an OLED laptop and uh, you want a little, you want Thunderbolt with it, and you want something that's portable. Also, I can flip the screen and all that. Um, just in case you guys want this laptop, you can find it on sale for, on, on, on eBay right now. Uh, just in case you want an old laptop with Thunderbolt. Uh, 
as you guys see very smooth real nice absolutely love it um man it's just gorgeous on here too this camera don't do it justice guys to be honest with you it just don't do it justice at all this is something you gotta see in person when it comes to this oled it's amazing and it runs buttery ain't even a word is it <laughs> man i was just talking out my ass right now don't worry about it um run smooth guys Runs real smooth run like butter um so yeah this is just an updated video guys um i got the gtx 1080 ti hooked up to the x1 yoga gn2 oled do the thunderbolt 40 gigabyte lane uh got two of them um like i said guys it works great if this is something that you're interested in doing um i say do it if you guys um got any other questions or got anything you want to ask me just Drop a comment in the comment section. Uh, I'll try to get back with you guys. It's been a long time since I made a video, and I'm probably going to start getting into some gaming videos now because uh, I got a shit ton of games. And, uh, you know, just to get you guys uh, more familiar. For anybody who don't know about the eGPU setups, I just want to get you guys more familiar with it so you guys uh, can get your game on, you know, sometime. All right. Peace. This your boy Deuce. Good talking to you guys. Peace.